Thanks for choosing intelligent and automated close racks of Guangdong Elbest Intelligent Technology Company Ltd. Our company has been treating each customer with our management philosophy: customer foremost, service first. The following video is the installation steps of Series M1 of automated close rack. Please watch. The first step: installation personnel must put on the costume and the hat provided by the enterprise, and wear work card and the covers of shoes before bringing the machine indoors. The second step: prepare all the instruments and materials that you may need during installation, such as double leather, percussion drilling, and its 10 millimeter drill, hammer. Cutting nippers, Phillips screwdriver, open end wrench of 14 millimeter, wire stripper, tape line, art knife, pencil, insulating tape, gelatin sponge, and so on. The third step: open the packing box and check the spare and accessory parts. One piece of locating template, one main frame, one pair of shear shanks. A set of clothes poles, four pieces, one remote controller, one sterilization lamp, and one bag of screws. A set of specification and warranty card. The fourth step: turn off the power of the balcony lamps. Then pull out the power cord about 20 centimeter long. Warm tips: if the power cord is not as long as 20 centimeter. You need to connect the power cord with another one that is about 20 centimeter long, in order to connect the cord of main frame conveniently. The fifth step: please measure with a tape line the appropriate positions according to the size of the machine and mark these positions. Take out the locating template in the packing box and stick the gelatin sponge on it. After that. You need to stick the template on the ceiling according to pressure marks. Then mark the positions of holes with pencil and pick the template off. The sixth step: drill holes in the marked positions with percussion drilling. The depth of the hole is about five centimeters. Then take out four pieces of plug bolts and hammer them into the ceiling. Make two screw nuts of plug bolts a bit out by ringing them with spanner, and ring both of the rest two completely out. The seventh step: separate the shell from the main frame with Phillips screwdriver. Put the double leather right under the position where the screw nuts were taken out. The eighth step: install the main frame. Take away the electric motor of the main frame, and make the U-shaped holes pass through the plug bolts, and then push U-shaped hole sides of the other side up straight, and lock the screw nuts tightly. The ninth step: test the wire with an electric marking pen to make sure it doesn't carry any electricity. Connect the power cord. The brown cord need to be connected to the live wire, the blue one to null line, and the green and yellow one to ground wire. And the three wire lines need to be wrapped respectively with gelatin sponge. The tenth step: and put this between the main frame and ceiling. You may need an open spanner to ring the screw nuts tightly, so as to fasten the whole main frame. Firmly beneath the ceiling. The eleventh step: install the shear shanks. Lock the shear shank with chain wheels to the side of the electric motor of the main frame, and the shear shank without chain wheels to the other side of main frame. And find out the M5 screws, which are used to fasten the shear shanks from the back of screws. Then fasten the shear shanks to the installation floor and cover it with shell. The twelfth step: pass the hoisting cable through the guard circles of shear shanks 
and hand the ends of the hoisting cable on the supporting hose of the shear shank, and close the decorative shell. Cut off the protecting film of the shear shanks, as is the same with other side. The thirteenth step: install the closed poles. Put two pieces of closed poles on the supporting board and switch on the power. The sounds of alarming will be heard from machine ten times, and after that, and push the bottom of lowering of controller, and stop the closed poles at a suitable height. Align the fixing poles with the installation holes and fasten the screws of the poles. Rive off the protecting film and install the sterilization lamp. The fourteenth step: debug the machine, test the controller, and with the controller, you can check if the machine's rising, lowering, blighting, sterilizing, and air drying operate rightly. Check whether the machine can stop when it meets with obstruction, and the function of overloading works normally. Code setting. A code setting is needed if the controller cannot operate well after the alarming when the power had been switched on. After turning on the power, the sound of alarming will be heard ten times. You must push the bottom of lighting and then the bottom of rising before the tenth sound of alarming is over, and then another three sounds of alarming will be heard, and the code setting of controller and mainframe is finished. Code deleting, a long press. Five to eight seconds on the bottom of lighting on the controller should be done, and when the ten sounds of buzzing are heard, you should immediately press the bottom of lowering. When another three rapid sounds of alarming are heard, the code deleting is finished. In the end, hand over the controller and instructions to the customer. If you puzzle or have some questions during the installation, please dial zero zero eight six four zero zero eight one six six two zero eight. Thank you.